Hi everyone, I'm Laurenzio and in this video I'm going to talk about all Cars games for the Sony PS2. Cars is it's one of the most beloved tie-in games and not for no reason. You get free roam, you can roam Radiator Springs and its surroundings and the map is huge for that time. And the gameplay is awesome too, for example when you race you can steer in 4 different ways. You can brake and turn, you can power slide, you can handbrake and drift, or you can go on two wheels. And you don't just race, you get to play with different characters too and fulfill different tasks, like going with Mater to scale tractors, or chase down people as the sheriff, or collect tires as Luigi. And not only this, the game is chock full of content. You can race as a monster truck, you can have a derby with rusty cars, you can just chill in Ray Tilter Springs, which is incredibly beautiful at night by the way. All in all, the game is a masterpiece. It's a love letter to all the Cars fans out there. Playing this game gives you a nostalgia trip for sure. And the good type of nostalgia trip, since the game, even for adults, is pretty good. Try it. Cars Meter National Championship has the same game engine and gameplay formula as the previous one. It has free roam and lots and lots of content. As differences, I can list the new story, obviously. The track designs are different. They are more complex now, having more narrow passages and tight turns. You'll need to drift or slow down more in the more complicated tracks here than in the previous game. Also, the car physics are different. They aren't better or worse, just different. Also, there are no piston cups, and in their place you get these rally cars with annoying personalities. There is a new race mode, the relay races where you switch characters at each checkpoint, and you get the same mini games as in the previous one, plus this one. Overall, even if the game is very similar to the other one, I consider it poorer than Cars 2006. It's hard to describe it, but once you start playing, you can notice that this game is more rushed. The content isn't as cohesive as in the other one, and the writing is more rushed. And on a second thought, the controls are worse too. They are different, and they aren't really that much worse, but still, they are worse than in the previous one, in my opinion. But even so, it still remains a really solid and good game. Cars Race Rama uses the same great gameplay formula the other games use. You. you get free roam, lots of races and minigames, also they nailed in this game what made the first one great, the sheer amount of content. Here too you get lots of minigames, and not only this, but you get more tracks and even ones that aren't set in radiated springs or the piston cup, and you can even free room in those new areas of the game. And the game even inclines me to call it the best out of the free room trilogy. But I have to warn you, that even if the games are good, you're way better off playing them on PC or 360 or PS3, and not only for the better graphics, but the gameplay is smoother and better too. For example on the bigger versions, the loading times are far less. Here on the PS2, if you want to cross to another map section for example, you have to wait for a loading screen and watch a cutscene. Oh, and by the way, what you see now in the video is actually the uncut footage of how you get from one map section to the other. That's why I don't recommend you the PS2 versions, and I recommend you the PC or 360 or PS3 versions. So you're better off with the PC, 360 or PS3 versions than the PS2 ones. But the PS2 ones aren't too shabby either. Okay, so this was the video. If you liked, please hit the like button and subscribe. If you want to financially support me in my pursuit to review as many video games as possible, you can do that on Patreon or on the channel's membership section. You will help me a lot. If you want, you can follow me on Twitch, Instagram or Discord. 
And if you want to see another video of mine, just wait till I stop talking and there will be thumbnails of other videos I've made. Thanks for watching.